The glitz, the glamour, and the celebrities all coming together for Hollywood's biggest night, the Oscars. For the second year in a row. If I see people laughing, I'll feel good about it. Late night host Jimmy Kimmel is leading the show. With a politically charged award season with movements like Me Too and Time's Up, Kimmel saying in an interview with ABC's Paula Ferris, he's hoping to set the right tone. Yeah, that, I do worry about that because I have a tendency to not strike the right tone. Um, in my life. <laughs> <laughs> this is not a joke. Moonlight and one year one after picture. that unforgettable envelope snafu. I'm still Moonlight. not clear Best on picture. how the wrong envelope got into Warren Beatty's hands. Color coding might be a nice thing to think of this time around, yeah. but um, I'll be honest, it would be funny if it happened again. Incredible performances by women this year shaping up for tough lead and supporting actress categories, but there is a favorite. Uh, Best Actress is certainly looks like Frances McDormand's award to win. And when it comes to those same categories for the men... Gary Oldman's chances of winning Best Actor are excellent. I would expect him to win. While experts have their top picks, the most talked about category, Best Picture, is still a toss-up. The Shape of Water has a great chance of winning Best Picture, but it's not a lock. Shape of Water is certainly a favorite, but get out with a good chance to pull a surprise.